Man, my energy regenerates so slow at this level. I have a level 110 Feral Druid. Um, I kind of, I'm, he's more of a bear tank, but I'll go Feral, obviously. And um, for when I need a DPS. And the energy regeneration is like night and day. Like, I can do one rake and then... Like, maybe a rake and a shred and then a ferocious bite. And then I'm out of energy. Whereas on my... My 110, just spam. You can like spam shred. Look at this. Freaking takes forever. All right, we got all this. Now we just have to make our way back to the guy at the beginning of the cave. Then we go turn all this in, and we Gucci, man. We Gucci. Is uh, which you used to? I think he was like the evil one. Wait. Oh God, I'm lost again. Oh, no, I gotta go this way. Okay. Thought that was it for some reason. God, I don't... I really do not miss Vanilla WoW. Like, people who, like, say they miss the old WoW do not understand anything. <laughs> about, like... Because apparently tedious... Making things tedious and, like, not well put together makes a game hard. Whereas, like, it's just making the content difficult. Like, rating now, if you ask any of the top guilds, is harder than it's ever been. But for some reason, people think, like... A new game in 2004 when people weren't used to MMOs. People did not play MMOs back then. People would click. They were clickers. They did not know mechanics. They did not know how to play these games. Apparently then is harder than when... That That's harder than now when the content's actually hard. Apparently. Like, take take the new Black Temple raid, for example. Like, the new time-walking Black Temple one, I should say. Oh, crap, I forgot to release his spirit. Oh, wait, don't I do it on his... Yeah, I do it on his dead body, okay. <laughs> um, people beat that and, like, without wiping the first time they played it. And, like, they should just go to show you volumes. Like, all they did was, like... They didn't mess with the mechanics. It's just the mechanics are... I mean, I guess people know the mechanics... Maybe, I guess you could say, but... Basically what I'm getting at here is the old fights used to not have many mechanics. They'd have, like, one mechanic. Once you figure it out, it's just like, okay. Also, there used to be 40 people. There used to be 40 people with, like, barely any gear that drops. So, like, half the people in your raid, you don't even know are good. You really don't even know their skill level. You had to, like, follow 40 people and hope that they knew what they were doing. And most of them were not geared up at all. So, of course it would make the fights harder than they were. I'm pretty sure if you added 40-man rating now... I mean, obviously it'll make it a little bit harder. I'm not, I'm not saying it wouldn't make it harder. Because, again, back to my point of having to gear everybody out, having to first find 40 people that even are remotely, like have a brain. I don't know. I don't know why I'm ranting about that. I really shouldn't be well ranting met. about that right now. Well met. Light be with you. Light be with you. Greetings. Greetings. King's honor for Ah, that freaking music, man. The first time I ever heard it. Mm. Oh, man. First time you play World of Warcraft, you can never get that feeling back with any game ever. Like, man. At least, I mean, I guess it's because most people who, when they play World of Warcraft, like, it was a new thing. Like, they've never played an MMO before. They've never played a game like this. And it's just like, oh, my God. Now, people have, like, oh played these open-world games. And they're just like, yeah, it's nothing. I don't feel it. Which, I guess, makes sense. I need to sell some stuff. Hey, who, who can I sell to? Sell to you, my Shaloman. Solomon. Shaloman. Shaloman. It's like Shaloman. Charlemagne. I need, to get, I need to get bigger bags. But I'm going to be so poor for so long. We are going to be very poor, my people. Very poor indeed. Farewell. Farewell. Greetings. I think I sold a lot of my buy and equip stuff, didn't I? I'm stupid. Eight slot bag. Hey, speaking of bags. Kill Ursal the Mauler. Where is Ursal Maul? Oh, he's up here. That's right. That's right. Level nine quest. We're starting to get to quests that actually are like giving me XP now. So that's cool. I'm a big fan of that. I do love me some XP. 
Alright, it is a good idea to start using this mount. I don't know why I didn't before, but I still won't use heirlooms until we get to, like, dungeons. Then I'll just take it off again if we get, like, any upgrades. You guys know how I do. Or do you know how I do? I don't know. Do you know how I do? I'm not sure. One of the harder, like, reputation grinds I'm not looking forward to with doing this is the, um... I'm not looking forward to doing, uh... What is that? I'm not looking to doing the Molten Core one, the Hydraxian Warlords. I'm not looking forward to doing the Pirates. Um, yeah, I'm not looking forward to a lot of that. It's going to be awful. It's going to be absolutely horrendous. Because I'm pretty sure for the Pirate thing, you have to kill like a million Pirates. And like, I'm just not looking forward to that. Gotta say. That one's not... That one's not, uh... Not... Rubbing me the right way. I've never done that one, actually, so that'd be... That would be interesting to try to do that... As a level 60. Because that's probably when I'm gonna start doing that grind, that grind on this character. And I'm kinda skipping every now and again. I'm not sure how the recording is. It, like, it's skipping on XSplit, but, like, when I look at it, it records normally, so it's really gonna suck if all this gets, like... All this is like messed up footage. Really gonna suck, actually. Ooh, almost fell off there. Is that a rare? Grimmaw? Hey! The rare's here, Grimmaw. Sweet. Why is... My game's like skipping out here. I might have to stop the... Stop the... We're getting so many bags. Why are we getting so many bags? I literally don't ever get these many bags. I don't even understand why this is happening. Hello, Ursong. I'm just gonna kill you with auto attacks. Hope you don't mind. Goodbye. Good day, sir. Good day. So, you used to be able to just... F oh, wait, no. Because I used to... D yeah, I did that once. I, f I went that way thinking it would be like a shortcut. No, it takes you all the way back to Shadow Glen. I would not... Would not recommend uh, jumping that way. So you jump this way. And hopefully don't die. <laughs> Whee! When do I get my... I get my talents at 15. No, 10. Was it 10? Did they make it 10? I think... Did they make it 10? I don't remember. I think they made it 15. I think they kept it 15, I should say. 20, we get rips. So that'd be cool. I might go balance for a little bit, too, but... I don't have, like, any intellect stuff on, but it doesn't... I guess it doesn't really matter. I could just... Can I activate it? Yeah, just... You know what? Let's just be a boomkin for a little bit. I do love be some boomkin. Boomkin's a fun fun thing. When do you get boomkin for him? Or moon moonkin for him? You get it at 20. Hmm. That's... Not fun. Um, put that there. Put this there. Ooh, we can teleport the Moonglade already? Wow. That'll be helpful whenever... Yeah, that'd be good. That will be good. Alright, put Moonfire there. When do we get Sunfire? We don't have our other Sunfire yet, do we? We don't. Ooh, 16. We get it to 16. Okay. I mean, we'll just stay Moonkin for him. I do like Moonkin. Moonkin's really fun. Like... A lot of people think, like, it'd be stupid, but, I mean, it's really easy. It's, like, brain-dead easy, you know? And you just dot things up. I mean, I like dotting things up. You just boom, boom, boom. Oh, I got the Gilneas Tabard on. That, that one's gonna be another annoying one. Having to run all those dungeons over and over and over again. Not looking forward to that. I'm just imagining how many times I'm going to have to run freaking... What's its face? Freaking, um... Uh... Oh, Molten Core. Because to get to Exalted with the Hydraxian Warlords, or Waterlords, uh, you... You have to run it, like... I think it's, like, 38 should, times or yeah. something like that, or 50? It might Farewell. even be in the 50s. I can't quite remember. But if you don't know... Basically, whenever you're... That, that you can only do it once a week, so... Yeah. That's 38 weeks. That's pretty much half a year. Oh, God. Oof. I just realized that, yeah, it's gonna be like half a year. Oh, God. Though, there is like a thing where you can like reset the the ads. So I might do that for quite a bit of it. But then you get to the point where only the bosses will give XP. And that kind of sucks. 
Alright, let's put some moon fire on everything. Moon fire. Moon fire. Moon fire. Ugh. Eat it. Ah, uh, this is actually kind of slower than just playing feral. Huh. Wait, I don't have my bear form on my bar. What am I thinking? How may I help? Be careful. I mean, I can always go bear form too. Guardian's really fun. Now let us, we have to wait for him to place. Uh, there's actually a quest over here. I'm gonna have to camp it out if he's actually not there. Well, we should go see if he's there right now, actually, because it's a rare that actually drops a quest, which is really annoying. It's really I think it's the only rare in the game that will drop like a quest if you're not counting like Tanan Jungle from like Warlords. Like, yeah, he's like the only rare that actually drops like a quest so that's obnoxious so yeah if he's not there I'm pretty much have to stop <laughs> so I didn't even think about that hopefully he's not dead his respawn timer is kind of long too and he spawns right over here I forgot about him hopefully he's there I don't know why anybody would be over here really maybe for the quest I guess yeah he's not here Okay, that's, that's obnoxious. Yeah. Oh wait, yeah, yes. Oh god, yeah. Get her. Tagged and bagged, baby. Sweet. Okay, that's awesome. So Lunar Strike's supposed to be an AoE, but the problem with it is the there it is. Boom. The problem with Starfire is that it's only five yards, so. They have to be quite stacked together for it to hit anything. Alright, so we got that. I'm happy. That's awesome. I'm actually quite happy about that. Alright. Now we just need Moon Conform. I love Moon Conform. A lot of people get the glyph where it makes you like a star, like celestial, like form. But I like just being the big bird. The big bird is the word. The bird is the word. What year is it? I don't know. Good question. When do we get travel form? We actually get travel form at 18, which they made it travel form go mount speed now. So there'll actually be no point to even have a mount. Just always have friggin'. We don't even need a mount. We'll just always be in travel form, which I don't mind. Travel form's awesome. Just spam moonfire on that bad boy. Which I need to loot all this stuff because be we're going to need all the gold God, we can get. Oh yeah, now we have to wait for him. That's the most annoying thing, is when you turn into something into him, you have to wait for him to plant it, and blah, 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 blah. Hurry up, please. Hurry it up. Dinalin. Hello. Dinalin, if that's your real name. Oh, really? Really, though? Really, though? Yes, you know what? Guide you. Eat it. Bam! Oh, there it goes. See that? See that bad boy? Bam! So cool. Freaking love Moonkin form. Greetings. It's awesome. Get three quests here. Alone light your path. Okay. Plant it. Booyah, what it give me a cleansed heart. Summons a Timberling to protect you for twenty minutes. Can I only use it once? Hey, we're level fifteen. Just realized that. Get anything new? We get talents, we get dungeon finder. We're probably not gonna use dungeon finder, to be completely honest. So summons a, a stand of three trants for ten seconds, which immediately taunt and attack enemies in the targeted area. Warrior of a Loon. This one's pretty good. Your next lunar strikes are instant cast. That one's really good. I usually go with that one. Lunar and solar impoundment also reduce the cast time of their effective spells by twenty percent. Um, yeah. Normally I go with Warrior of a Loon just because you get those instant. Which you're not really supposed to use lunar strike as like a like a on a single target, but. I'm probably going to go with that now, just to kill things faster, too. Which, Force of Nature is fun. I don't think you really ever get Force of Nature, though. I think you just go Warriors of Luna, Star-Lord. I think it's usually Star-Lord, though, is the one you're supposed to go. And then I can go, like, bam! Pull him like that. Probably should just use Moon Form to pull him, honestly, but... What are you going to do? I guess that, I mean, I guess that's how I'm going to play this. I'm just going to pull everything with Moonfire, get it all really close, and just spam Lunar Strike. And then hope we don't freaking die. Bam! Shoot stars at people. I mean, how awesome is that? You literally shoot stars at people. Hello? Hello? 
Am I insane? Sadly, they are very spread out, which is quite annoying. How much damage does this thing do? Hits for... Damn, it hits pretty hard, actually. And I never used this thing. This is actually the first time I've actually used this little guy that you get. Can you use him over and over again? No, you can only use him once. I mean, hey, it's still... F I mean, I'll take it. Awesome. Yeah, th okay, so we definitely are killing stuff faster as Boomkin, for sure. Oh, a little, little bit of skip in there. I'm really hoping that this stuff's not messed up, which if it's messed up, you're not going to even know any of this. Alright, we don't have to kill any more of those guys, which we're, we're going to have to kill more of them because they're going to just... They're going to attack me. Hmm... I'm gonna have to go across the river. Across the river and through the woods to Grandma's house we go. Do, 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 do. Probably gonna turn this quest in and stop for the night. Uh, like I said, I'm not really gonna play too much here tonight. We might get 20 by the end of all this. Possibly. Possibly. Which, uh, we'll probably do PvP every now and again, too, like I said. Though, then again, we don't we don't need heirlooms anymore for PvP. It used to be like, if you didn't have heirlooms on PvP at low level, you might as well not even be playing it. But then they did that thing, and that was cool. They did that thing where they made it so, like, you have preset stats and stuff. So that really helped. Like, that was one of the best additions they've ever done to this game in a long time. <laughs> Which I really like artifact weapons, honestly. Like, I quite enjoy the artifact weapons. That was really cool, too. I don't know if they'll keep doing it for the next expansion. I think it's only for this expansion. But hopefully they do something, like, similar or something. Because it's pretty awesome. Gotta say. Just, just kind of looking at the towels that we get. Uh, I don't really look at balance too much. Because my druid, my 110 druid, I actually don't play balance too often. So, he gets Stellar Flare, another another dot, just add like three dots. It's awesome. Can I assist you? Can I assist you? Good luck, friend. Alright. Is he planting anything or are we done? Oh, he bowed, okay, he bowed to me. I guess we're done. I guess we're done with him. Alright, and there's a quest over at Dalinar. I think, I think that's just going to tell me to go over here and... Maybe I'll finish Teldrassil. I might finish Teldrassil tonight. I don't know. Probably should, because Dylan's wanting to... Dylan's probably going to, like, join in this Let's Play every now and again. And it'd probably be easier for him to catch up to me if... I finish Teldrassil, and I can be like, Yeah, you can finish Teldrassil or something if you want to make a Night Elf. What brings you Fill the Amethyst. Yeah. Wait, what? Oh, he wants to be filled way over there. Dude, come on now, come on now, boy. Oh yeah, I was wanting to do all the lore, all the uh, well reds. I need to deactivate that add-on. There's an add-on that tells me about the midsummer stuff, but like midsummer is over, so I need to like not do that. So also apparently there was an auction house dance party. How long does the auction house dance? Oh, it's only one day. It's one of their new ones. Kieran Tor Tavern Crawl. What the heck is that? I don't know what that is. Kind of curious about that. Tavern crawl. It's quite interesting. All right, guys. Uh, I think I'm gonna end it here. I'll be back um, with more World of Warcraft. Hope all of you are happy that I recorded a little bit of this today. Peace off.